Hello folks, I'm Steve Judd, professional astrologer, and you've reached my forecasts for January 2013 for every sign of a zodiac. Brought to you not only by myself, Steve Judd, but also by the wonderful people at AskTheAnswer.com, the UK's leading telephone chat line for psychics, mediums, channelers. Enjoy the readings. And this is Scorpio. I expect you're already getting sick of me talking about Scorpio and Saturn, but nevertheless, Saturn is now entering his fourth month of a long-term stay with you. He's about 10%, maybe 12% of the way through your sign. And um, as I speak, he's passing over the sun sign position of those of you born around um, August the 2nd, 1st, 2nd, 3rd, possibly 4th. And those of you born at the very start of August may well be experiencing quite a degree of blockage, restriction, limitation, or circumstances outside of your control that are seeming to hold you back. It's as if there's a kind of pressure or gravity that's stopping you from doing what you want to do. If you're experiencing this, if you've been experiencing this if you're experiencing this during January or have been experiencing this over November or December, then the message is clear. Stop pushing. Step back and, and actually just be a little bit more flexible and tolerant. And if you can't get somewhere, then don't go there. Saturn's making you re-examine and re-evaluate everything that's uh, not working at the moment. You have to ask yourself why it isn't working. Really, why isn't it working? And what are the options are? You're not going to get clear answers on this for a few months, but at the moment, you're really finding out what it is you don't want. And this is carrying on into all of you, not just these people. January is not a particularly easy month. There can be a number of, uh, not so much confrontations, but flashpoints, particularly in areas around home and family. You can find that individuals will not be as diplomatic or sensitive as they might normally be. And as a result, your buttons can get pushed. This is primarily down to having Mars squaring your sign and every one of you is going to go for a two or three day period during January where you do get your buttons pushed big time. And the tendency to just go for the jugular will be stronger than normal. But of course, the sensible amongst you won't do that. You're not going to find this a particularly more difficult or challenging month than any other, particularly those of recent times. But it's not a month for progress forward. It's a month to sort of keep your shields up to an extent, maintain your boundaries, and uh, check your long-term objectives. Time for consolidation, not growth. As far as January 2013 goes, Scorpio, huh. have a detached month. There you go, folks. I hope you enjoyed that. My name's Steve Judd, professional astrologer. You can find out all about me on my website, stevejudd.com. And I'll be here again, same time, same place, next month, brought to you by these wonderful people at asktheanswer.com. Have a great month. See you in February. Bye.